We were initially formed in 1966 by the creation of two individual teacher training colleges. In December 2012, we were awarded by the Privy Council University title, and so we became Leeds Trinity University. Gabby was announced as Chancellor on the 6th of January to great excitement all round. She's the new Chancellor of Leeds Trinity University. There she is. I think everyone was really pleased to, to see that we've managed to secure someone as um, prestigious and as well known as Gabby Logan. There's also a strip club underneath, so be careful. <laughs> <laughs> when we knew we were having Gabby, no worries, you later. we knew Chancellor, they need a gown. And so we started to think about uh, what that gown might look like. And rather than following the normal academic route, we thought, uh, wouldn't it be really good to have a, a very special bespoke gown for our first chancellor? And then we thought, where better to have that made than in Yorkshire? And to actually base it around the Yorkshire textiles, you know, 200 years of history. We began discussions with Armley Mills, uh, who introduced us to Hainsworth. Hainsworth provided the textile. Samuel Brothers did the cutting and finishing. Being a, an educational establishment, we thought, well, really, we should be supporting the youth. And so we then um, employed a recent graduate, Kate Duckworth, to design and to you know, do the final making of the garment. We also wanted it to not just represent Yorkshire, but also to have various different elements that are very bespoke to, to Lee's Trinity. And so there are various features to the gown which represent parts of the logo of the university. The colours are very much the, the corporate colours of the university. There's basically different parts of the design which represent parts of the history of the university. I'm really chuffed that it's taking place uh, here in the, in the chapel um, because that, in a very understated way, uh, underlines the, the fact that we are uh, a Catholic Foundation University. Uh, but at the same time, it shows that we are serious about uh, academic attainment. I will encourage, support and promote this university at every opportunity, wherever in the world my work takes me while always remembering the special ethos upon which this university is built. Thank you. I think we're going to have fun. It's a real public statement about the university. It has the honour, it has the pomp, it has the ceremony that's needed to be able to send out a big message that this is a big event for the city. The city will want to know what's happening and share in the process. I think Gabby being our Chancellor has given us a good atmosphere uh, within the campus. It's given everybody a good uh, sense of what's going on and like they're a massive part of something. You go to a lot of universities and you ask them who their Chancellor is and uh, most of them won't be able to tell you but if you come here and you ask anyone they'll be able to tell you straight away who it is and to me that's significant because it shows that she's getting involved with the students already. She tweets students, she, uh, she's done a master class in a TV studio and for someone of her stature to come here and impart her specialist knowledge on students that will really value it, I think that's, that's really special. <laughs> I think Trinity University is different to a lot of universities um, for a few reasons really. It's grown, evolved and I think it's, it's been able to take the best of the education system in this country. It's been able to learn from other universities. Um, it has a thriving campus, a beautiful campus which is on the edge of a, of a brilliant city but there is that element that you can just pull yourself away from it but you don't have to be in the middle of the, uh, of the throng if you like and I understand that the, the plans are to do more on campus which I think is a really good thing. I've been speaking uh, to some of the students who are behind those plans. I think it's also got that very strong link with the church which means it's got a very caring pastoral element to it and I think a lot of students will benefit from that. It doesn't mean that you have to go to Mass every day, I think it's about knowing that there is somebody there for you to talk to, somebody there who can, who can just embrace you when you have problems and issues and I think a lot of students will, will really benefit from that and it will benefit their academic studies to know that. Oh, It's been a fantastic day. The actual ceremony and the, the whole way it's all been conducted, the fantastic choirs, the wonderful speeches and, and seeing so many familiar faces here has been a really lovely day.